okay so let us see what is there in this question boiling water is heated in a 2 kilowatt electric kettle the initial mass of the water is 0 0.4 kgs assume the specific latent heat of vaporization of the water to be 2 megajoule per kg what is the time taken for all of the water to vaporize okay so first of all the temperature of the water is not given but it is given that it is boiling so we will safely assume that the temperature is 100 degrees centigrade already so it means only and only the phase change is taking place as i have told you earlier the heating is divided into two parts like one is sensible heat it is the heat which is used to raise the temperature and the formula used is q is equal to mc delta t and the second one is the latent heat so it is the heat which is actually hidden inside the substance that is it means there is no uh, temperature change there it, and the formula used here is q is equal to m into l so there is no term which is which talks about delta t or change in temperature now this question is specifically about the latent heat and the phase transformation fine so uh, what will be the heat that is required specific latent heat is given so in this question first of all we will find like what is the heat that is required so mass is 0 0.4 kgs multiply by the latent heat that is 2 megajoule divided by kgs i have written the units also just to make sure that everything fall in place kg and kgs are getting cancelled out so we would be having 0 0.8 megajoule so this much is the energy that is required to evaporate all of the water now the question is in how much time so now we concentrate on the heating coil in the electric kettle it is uh, having the rating of 2 kilowatt so the power so the power can be taken as 2 kilowatt that is 2 kilojoule per second so we want to find the time so definitely the time will be q divided by p and q is 0 0.8 into mega so now i'm just converting mega into 10 raised to powers so it is 10 to power 6 and we divide by 2 into 10 raised to power 3 that is kilo and the answer will come in seconds so this is how we do this let us see this is 3 and we remove the decimal this becomes a 4 and this becomes 100 so it's 400 second so i think the time that will be taken to evaporate that much of the water in this kettle is 400 second so our answer will be b this is how we do this question so my dear students this is professor varun please subscribe to the youtube channel it will be highly beneficial for your preparation and share the youtube channel with all your friends also all the best